Esports is a catch-all term for the competitive playing of video games. Champlain College in Burlington has a varsity esports program. And as Fox 44's Mike Hoey shows us, it now has a brand new arena to play in. Mike? It does, Lauren. Now, besides two varsity teams, Champlain offers club-level esports teams, too. All of them at both levels are highly ranked, and they all have a new place to compete and practice on Lakeside Avenue in Burlington's South End. Champlain College's eSports Arena has more than two dozen PC stations, a training room, and a full broadcasting suite for live streaming on Twitch and elsewhere. A senior on the varsity team for Valorant, a first-person shooter game, has watched the program come a long way in a short time. I was on the team when it was just a small club team where we all played remote, and to see it, you know, grow to be such a this program over a year has been incredible. I grew up watching some games, watching my friends play games. Never thought that I would be playing in such an environment where, you know, I have coaches and managers and people looking at everything I'm doing. One of those people recently graduated from Champlain. The college has offered a four-year academic program in video game development for nearly 20 years now. A lot of our players are actually from our game development program. Me myself, I was a game program here at the college. Uh, it's really a good way to get our people into the school and it's kind of like a no-brainer. You know, we're a game development, game-focused school. To have our biggest sport be esports, it's kind of the perfect mix. Champlain's director of esports was studying for a master's in fine arts a few years ago. He was one of the first people to recognize that varsity esports would be a natural fit on campus. We petitioned to make it happen. Though five years ago, the landscape was very different. I think there were maybe like three or four programs happening uh, at, at that time, and now there's over 200, 250. This past spring semester, Champlain became one of them. It was a student-led effort nearly a decade in the making. I'm just so inspired by their leadership. They really created and brought this whole esports arena and program to life. We're going to welcome people from the community, and I think it's just going to be uh, uh, just a real jewel for, for our state. President Alex Hernandez helped open the arena Thursday by playing his first ever esports match. He defeated student government president Martina Monroe 6 to 1 in a game of Rocket League. Now, we mentioned one of the varsity programs, Lauren, plays Valorant. The other one plays Rocket League. And if you'd like to watch Champlain Esports compete, I'm going to include a link to their Twitch channel tonight within this story on our website, myshamplainvalley.com. Live in the studio, Mike Hoey, Fox 44 News. Looks like fun. Mike, thank you. If the Champlain Valley Fair